Okay. Um, the easiest one, class, is what if find the equation of a line and slope intercept form or standard form given a slope and a y intercept. Ha? Or intercept. Pero ang ibig sabihin talaga ng slope at saka intercept, y intercept talaga yung intercept doon. So, paano to? Meron tayong tinatawag class na slope intercept form. And slope intercept form is y equals slope intercept form. Yan, alam nyo yan. Tama? So, I'll just copy the form plus substitute lang. Ilan si M? 2. It becomes 2x. Ilan si B? 1. So, 2x plus 1. So, ito na ang answer mo. The equation of a line in slope intercept form is y equals 2x plus 1. Ito ang slope intercept form. Pero what if the question is find the equation of a line in slope intercept form and standard form? Okay, ano man ang standard nito? Ilipat si 2x sa kabila. So it becomes negative 2x plus y equals 1. Tama? Bawal negative si x. So, ang mangyari ngayon, multiply natin both sides by negative 1. Negative 1 times negative 2x, positive 2x. Negative 1 times y, negative y. Na 1 times negative 1, negative 1. So, ito na naman ang equation of a line mo in standard form. Depende lang ako ano ang tinatanong sa, sa question. Another example. M is negative 3. B is equal to negative 4. Okay. Following the formula, Y equals MX plus B. Ilan si M? Negative 3X. Ilan si B? Minus 4. Wag ka na maglagay ng plus negative 4. Kasi plus kasi yung formula says, naglagay ako ng plus. Pag minus ganun yung given na, ay, pag negative ganun yung given na B, there's ako naglagay ng minus 4. Okay? So, ito na ang final answer mo sa slope intercept form. I-substitute mo lang. Ka-answer ka na. Pero what if ang tinatanong standard form? Anong gagawin kay negative 3x? Lipat sa kabila. Negative man siya. Magiging positive 3x plus y equals negative 4. Final answer na ba to? Oo, oh, oh, final answer na to. So, ito na naman ngayon ang kanyang standard form. Okay, let's see kung sino nakatama sa number 3 at sino rin nakatama sa number 4. Let's solve number 3. Y equals mx plus b. Substitute, what is our m? Negative 5x. What is our b? 10. Okay, ayun. O, meron ka ng slope intercept form. What if, ano ang standard form ngayon? Ano kaya? So, lipat sa negative 5x. Negative man siya, class. Pag lipat, magiging positive 5x plus y equals 10. Final answer na ba to? Yes, final answer. Kasi hindi na naka-negative, hindi rin naka-fraction. So, ito na ang final answer mo sa standard form. Okay? Number 4. Sige, kopyahin ko muna para madali ko mang substitute. So, 6x, ilan si b? May ne negative 2. So, minus 2 ka na diretsyo, ha? So, yan ang answer mo sa slope intercept form. Ano na kayo ng answer ng standard form dyan? Lipat si positive 6x, ilipat sa kabila, it becomes negative 6x plus y equals negative 2. Nalipat lang siya doon, ha? So, Final answer na ba to? Hindi, kasi may negative ang x. So, anong gagawin natin? Multiplied by negative 1. Multiplied by negative 1. Negative 1 times negative 6x. Positive 6x. Negative 1 times y. Negative y. Negative 2 times negative 1. Positive 2. So, ito na ngayon ang final answer mo sa standard form. Okay, let's see kung sino nakatama sa numbers 5 and 6. Sige, let us solve number 5. Y equals mx plus b. Ilan si m? 1 half x. Ilan si b? 4 plus 4. So, ito ang answer sa slope intercept form. How about sa standard form? Lipat si 1 half x. It becomes negative 1 half x 
plus y equals 4. Di ba bawal si negative? So, multiply natin ang negative 1. Pero bawal man din fraction class. So, ay, paano natin tanggalin si 2? Multiply din ang 2. So, isahin na lang natin. Multiply na natin ng negative 2 both sides. So, negative 2 times negative 1 half. Di ba? Ang answer is x na lang. Negative 2 times negative 1, 2. 2 divided by 2, 1. 1x. One Walang maglagay ng 1x ha. Negative 2 times y, negative 2y. 4 times negative 2, negative 8. Okay, so, ito na ang answer sa standard form. Ngayon, sa number 6 na naman tayo, tingnan natin kung sino ang nakatama. What is our m? Negative 2 third x plus 4. Okay, that's it. That's your answer. Standard, ay standard, slope intercept form. Ano ngayon ang standard form? Lipat si negative 2 third. 2 third x. So, it becomes positive 2 third x plus y equals 4. Is this our final answer? No, nope, kasi bawal fraction. Paano matanggal si 3? Multiply both sides by positive 3. Paano matanggal si 3? 3 divide 3, di ba? Wala na tanggal na yan. So, 2 na lang maiwan. 2x. 3 times 2, 6. 6 divide 3, o 2. Or cancel ka na diretsya dyan. 3 times y, plus 3y. 4 times 3, that's 12. So, ito na ngayon ang ating answer. Sa standard form. Um, another way to find the equation of a line is that the given are both intercepts. X intercept or A is 3, Y intercept or B is equal to 2. So, what is the equation of a line in a slope intercept form and standard form? Um, kung kaya pa ng space. Sige. Class, ang ituturo ko, alam naman natin na ang intercept form ay X over A plus Y over B equals 1. Tama? But ang ituturo ko ngayon, class, is shortcut na. Hindi natin yan gamitin. Ang gagamitin natin na formula ngayon is ganito. Negative B over AX plus B. Okay? So, ngayon, substitute. Ilan si B? 2. May negative man dyan. So, it becomes negative 2. Ilan si A? 3. Kopya si X. Ilan si B? 2. Plus 2. So, this will be our equation of a line in the slope intercept form. Okay? Yan ang shortcut. Pag ito ang gagawin natin class, matagalan tayo, pero easy pa rin to. Pero ito ang pinaka-easy sa lahat. So, in standard form, ano ang answer nito? It becomes 2 third x. Lipat si negative 2 third. It becomes positive 2 third. Plus y equals 2. Paano matanggal si 3? Multiply 3 both sides. Final answer, 2x plus 3y equals 6. Ito din ang sa standard form. Okay? Another example daw. Negative 3. B is negative 1. Okay, what is the equation of a line in standard form and slope-intercept form? Unahin natin si slope-intercept class kasi mas madali. Ilan si B? Negative 1. So, negative man yung formula. Negative times negative 1. Again ha, negative B. So, sa negative, copy. Ilan si B? Negative 1. Substitute. Ilan si A? Negative 3. Copy the X. Ilan si B? Negative 1. So, hindi na ako mag plus minus 1. Diretso na, minus 1. Negative times negative 1. Positive 1. Oh, ito lang answer mo. Y equals negative 1 third X minus 1. Ano naman ang kanyang... Standard form, lipat si one-third class. Sorry ha, pag kasi wala na masyadong space. So, it becomes negative man. It becomes positive. Negative 1 na lang. May iwan dito. Lipat naman to sa kabila. Paano matanggal si 3? Multiply both sides by 3. Ano ang final answer? X plus 3Y equals negative 3. Yan. Okay, um, ano kaya ang answer nito? 
So, copying the shortcut class negative b over a x plus b, substitute natin yung mga values ha. So, negative man yan dyan. Ilan si b? Negative 5. Hindi yan siya negative 5. O, si may negative, tapos may negative pa dyan. So, ilan si a? 3. Copy the x. b is negative 5. So, what's the answer now? Y negative times negative, that's 5 third x minus 5. O, oh, yan ang answer. Ano naman ang standard form? Lipat si 5 thirds sa kabila. So, it becomes negative 5 thirds. Bakit na sulat plus? Negative 5 thirds x plus y equals negative 5. Paano matanggal si negative? Multiply natin ang negative. Paano matanggal si 3? Multiply natin ang 3. So, multiply na natin. Isahin na natin as negative 3. So, ang answer is... Negative times negative, positive na. 3 divide 3 cancels. So, it may iwan. 5x. Pangit ng 5. 5x. Negative 3 times y. Negative 3y equals negative 3 times negative 5. Positive 15. Okay, ito ang standard form. How about number 4? y equals negative b over ax plus b. Y equals, ilan si B? 6, negative 6. Ilan si A? Negative 2. Ilan si B? Plus 6. Negative 6 divided by negative 2. Ano ang sagot? The answer is positive 3. Dalawang negative, positive. Plus 6. So, ito na ngayon ang ating slope-intercept form. Ano ang standard form? Lipat si 3x. Plus y, maiwan na lang ang constant, 6. Final answer, na ba to? Hindi. Ano ang bawal? Bawal negative si x. Times negative 1. Times negative 1. Becomes 3x. Negative 1 times negative 3, positive 3. Negative 1 times y, negative y. Neg 6 times negative 1, negative 6. So, ito ngayon ang ating answer.